Hi, I'm Steve Datz. I'm a local artist from Skinny Atlas, and the Schweinfurt has been generous enough to offer me this show. And it's a show of paintings and sculptures um, over quite some period of a time, but the paintings are fairly recent. The show's titled Intention and Perception. I have an intention in all my work, but perception is left up to the viewer. Um, with this particular series, it's, it's called Makoko. The Makoko series was kind of arrived upon the fact that I was weaned in modernism. And I have also studied art history. And the Renaissance was followed by the Baroque. The Baroque was followed by mannerism to Baroque, Baroque to Rococo. If I place that same context in a timeline of modernist paintings, it was modernism, postmodernism, a conglomeration that follows that and my personal interpretation of it, which is Makoko. Um, these paintings in particular are parquets, and I'm kind of challenging the idea of single surface painting. If, there, if a two panel painting is called a diptych, is this a multiptych? Um, and what the idea of using panels and pieces and putting them together allows me to manipulate the surface almost in a sculptural way, which I was trained in, and then applying uh, painterly techniques to, to make an image that is somewhat in between what I would call them paintings because they're contained in a frame. This one in particular has gone through a lot of transition. And one of the, the things that's different about these than some other painting is that most painting, I would say, is more like focusing a camera. You start with a vague image that comes into more and more focus and then is finished with smaller details. These are kind of in reverse of that sometimes, is that I start with actually the finest aspects of the painting and then work backwards. And the risky, scary part is actually applying large areas of color and mass to them late in the painting process where it could actually go really wrong. So, <laughs> I mean, I could mess these up. Uh, pretty easy and it's 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 quite an exercise to practice what I would call nurtured spontaneity in which because of past activity have the ability to fluidly do something late in a process that normally wouldn't come easy.